the LAPD is investigating Nicole Young over an alleged embezzlement. Oh, that's wonderful. Oh, yeah. So. They got, they got the man on you. Love it. <laughs> Love it. Love it. Our buddies at TMZ told, uh, telling us that Dr. Dre Double just, penetration. Love oh, it. Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> Okay. It's coming. GPS is firing up. I can see. But it, well, listen to this, GPS. Dr. Dre's estranged wife, Nicole Young, is being investigated by the LAPD for alleged embezzlement. So we're told that Dre's business partner recently went to the police and filed a report claiming that Nicole withdrew hundreds of thousands of dollars from their business account without authorization. Something Foolish. something that he had previously alleged in legal letters fired off to Nicole's side in the past few weeks. So in this report to the LAPD, Dr. Dre's team claims that Nicole embezzled $385,029. Or the LAPD detectives were aware and believes that Nicole is the culprit and Start they are looking into it now. So for the record, Dre did not file the report. Dre called out Nicole for two withdrawals, which totaled the $385,000 in their divorce case. Nicole has said that she had a right to the money in that corporate account because her name is on it. If charges are brought forth from this, it's possible Nicole will do some time. So Nicole's legal team has previously told that these claims are nothing but a smear attempt and a PR stunt as she navigates her pending divorce from Dr. Dre. Her attorneys maintain right, she's good. done nothing wrong thus far. It depends, man. Like, when they separated, see, if they were still married and she took the money out the account, then she, yeah, she's not at any, she, she is, there's no criminal charges can be brought to her. But if she knew that they were going to part ways and it, and they were physically separated from each other, and mm -hmm. she went in and took that money out. Yeah, her ass is grass. It depends. It's a timeline, man. It really depends on the timeline. Did she do this after she filed for divorce, or did she do it before she filed for divorce? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Very true. Uh, a GPS? So, uh, so now, what do you think of this new chapter? If she had no authorization to that business account, then, yeah, she's done. Even if it's okay? in her name? And I don't it, you said if it's in her name or it, his name? It's in her name. Well, she's still going to have to account to the IRS for what she did with that money. Mm -hmm. You ain't just take 365 and, you know, go buy penny candy with it. You know, you're going to have to account for that money some way. And I'm glad the police <laughs> want to know. Because you're going to answer them. Oh, yes, man. Yes, I love it. So, uh, do, you, do you feel she's going to jail? I hope so. <laughs> It depends on her legal team, man. She got a good legal team. She probably get probation, man. Mm -hmm. But the damage has already been made, man. Her ass is, is divorced. You know, they probably going to be like, all right, um, we're going to take a little bit of that money that you stole. We're going to probably take it out your, out your um, wife, you know, support, whatever. So we'll see how it plays out. Mm -hmm. Definitely will because th this, this uh, tumultuous – divorce that's been uh happening for dre i know it's draining for him and yes it is draining for for nicole young too dre really needs a, a victory you know the victors go to spoils and, and he deserves justice and that and that's my two cents on this i see man i i i hope he come out with a chronic three. Oh my god for all this bullshit that he went through man you take it to the studio bro take all this shit mm -hmm. that's been going on take the studio i i'm looking i'm anticipating a chronic three man oh my god and yeah you said his first song should be divorce bitch if that's what he wants to do man because he got a lot of subject matter now to yeah. work with he got tons of subject matter dre Congratulations once again for you, for this victory. I mean, nobody should have to go through this first and foremost, but you you went through this and hopefully justice will prevail and that money will come back to you.